Hi, Orange Room friends. We're going to finish up with five little monkeys reading in bed. Remember, they were jumping on the bed before? Now they moved on to something a little different, and they're reading in bed. Now remember, the print or the text on the page is shown in the pictures that are on the page. So can you look for the words as I read them? And the pictures that are on the page, like if I say the word monkey, you can look for the monkeys on the page. Or if I say the word book, then you can look for the books that are on the page. So let's get started. When five little monkeys are ready for bed, their mama reads stories, then kisses each head. Do you remember in our first book that we were working on the words bed and head, and we hear them again? So listen for them as we read the story and other words that rhyme. It's bedtime for monkeys. Now turn out the light. Oh, mama, oh, please, one more story tonight. So they just want one more. But mama's too tired. She's read more than four stories. Lights out, sweet dreams, and she closes their door. One monkey whispers, this book looks so good. If mama won't read it, then maybe we could. So look, do you think they're going to bed? I don't think so. The monkeys start reading. The story is sad. One monkey is weeping. She's feeling so bad. It's snowing. That puppy is lost. Then out come the tissues. They all start to bawl. They sob and they cry till the last page of all. It's such a good ending, their sobs turn to cheers. Those monkeys are loud. You should cover your ears. Hooray, hooray, yay. And remember, they're supposed to be quiet and go to bed. This isn't very quiet, is it? In fact, they're so noisy that Mama runs in. What is all this racket, this chaos, this din? Uh, one monkey admits with a guilt-written look, um, we've been reading the very best happy sad book. Mama raises an eyebrow. What was it I said? Lights out, sweet dreams, no more reading in bed. Hmm. How many of you think that they're going to read something else? I do. Then one monkey sighs as she turns out the light. <sighs> I wish we could read this new ghost book tonight. Just look at that goblin and mean looking ghost. It's those shadowy bats I like the most. One monkey starts hooting an eerie ghost sound, and soon they're all wailing and jumping around. Now, if they're wailing and jumping around, do you think they're quiet like Mama asked? I don't think so. Then dark, spooky shadows appear on the wall, and a knock at their door is what frightens them all. It's the ghost, they all scream, but then... Mama walks in. What is all this racket, this chaos, this din? The monkeys all gasp. <gasps> we thought you were the ghost. This book is so scary. We like it the most. Mama raises an eyebrow. What was it that I said? Hmm. Lights out, sweet dreams, no more reading in bed. One monkey shivers. Whew, that book was creepy and so good, but so scary. I will never be sleepy. She pulls out a joke book. Oh, we've got to be quiet, but the jokes are so funny. In fact, they're a riot. Now look, they're out of bed and they're reading again on the floor. The monkeys try hard not to giggle or laugh. <laughs> but then there's a joke with a foolish giraffe. Why do giraffes have long necks? So they can wear lots of ties. Ha, 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 ha. All the monkeys start laughing. It's so silly and so goofy. They all start to roar. And then can you guess who flings open that door? Oh, yes, it's Mama. She comes storming right in. What is all this rackers, racket, this chaos, this din? Look, they're laughing pretty loud, all of them over here on the floor. The monkeys keep giggling. They just cannot quit. Mama picks up their books. I've had it. That's it. Then she raises an eyebrow. Do you hear what I said? Lights out. Sweet dreams. No more reading in bed. Well, the monkeys are tired. They're almost asleep when they hear someone giggle, then laugh, then weep. Do you hear all that noise? And just who can it be? Let's sneak down the hall. Can you guess what they see? 
Who do you think is making all that noise? <gasps> it's Mama! Oh, Mama, they giggle. What was it you said? Because what's she doing in this picture? Do you remember those books that she picked up? Now she's reading them. Lights out, sweet dreams, and no reading in bed. Those monkeys are sleepy. They head out the door. Just wait till tomorrow, and then we'll read more. And then look, all five monkeys are going to bed. Do you remember in the end of our other story, it was Mama who was jumping on the bed, and now she's reading in bed. I hope you enjoyed the story. Bye, Orange Room friends.